hello guys so this is our next problem for today and the problem is 25a court forces and the problem link is slash problem slash 25 slash a so the problem is named as iq test and bob is preparing to pass an iq test the most frequent task in the test is to find out which one of the given n numbers differ from the others bob observed that one number usually differs from the other in even nibs help Bob to check his answers. He needs a program that among the given n numbers find one that is different in evenness. Input The first line contains integers n, the amount of numbers in the task. The second line contains n sep space separated integers natural numbers not exceeding 100. It is guaranteed that exactly one of these numbers differ from the others in evenness. So we have to check that whether like what are from a given set of numbers uh, what is the number that is uh, different from the set so we have to just uh, it is also written that there is exactly one of these numbers that differ from others in evenness <coughs> so what we have to do here is that uh, we have to just count the last index of even or odd and check which one of the count is one so let's just um, describe it by taking a test case so let's say for our test case first 2 4 7 8 10 so 2 4 7 8 and 10 uh, sorry for that so we see that the last odd integer is at index 2 so the output is 2 okay so we have to uh, not count from 0 1 2 now uh, it would be 2 plus 1 so it is 3 so yes uh, let's check for the next test case 1 2 1 1 so we see that the last even number is at index 2 so the answer is 2 here so that's a very basic implementation problem and let's just dive into the code problem number 25a um, so So like our n equals to sc dot next int which is uh, which contains the number of tasks the amount of numbers in the task and now we have to just input the number and test we just maintain the count of even count of odd numbers index even index odd so let's just analyze to zero initialize to zero and we have to check that c dot next int mod 2 equals to equals to zero uh, that doesn't work so, yep that works so that means even number so we have to count even plus plus and okay count even is not initialized I think so no problem okay so yep that is all about index even equals to like okay so how can we store the index so what we can do here is that um okay 
so uh, like we should not use while here and we can replace it by this so that would work for our index 2 that would uh, without initializing another variable that is the same basically so that is no problem else count odd plus plus and index odd equals to i so yep now for the at the end of the loop we have to check if count even equals to equals to zero equals to equals to one as it says as the problem says that they are exactly one of these number then you have to print index even plus one uh, but I have I it plus one because okay so index even equals to zero so why have and done plus one because we have to uh, not count from zero and we have to count from one so yep that's all about the problem and let's finally run that and check whether that passes over test case or not so why it is not working um, mm -mm. zero one two three four okay let me just run it once again yep it is working for three and then for two yep it is finally working let's just submit this solution to the Cut forces and see whether we passes our test case or not. So So yes, finally the problem is accepted and this is the solution to our problem 25a. Uh, guys, I am also adding the solution to the GitHub repository and you can check out it at any time and also contribute uh, so that you can also learn. So yep, that's all guys. Uh, next problem is antenna letters that is coming up soon. Keep subscribing, keep learning. Bye bye, good night.